Next, let's look at the word live. So here, this is a verb and probably the most common use of the word live, right? But there are two meanings, two meanings for this verb. It can be, number one, to remain or stay alive, or two, probably what you're most used to, to make one's home in a particular place. So first, let's look at to remain alive. For example, he got into a car accident and fortunately he lived. This means he stayed alive, right? Did not die. Very lucky, he lived. He remained alive. Another common use of the verb live as a word meaning to remain alive, we might hear at a doctor's office. The doctor said she has one year to live. So maybe uh, this is some your grandmother who's very old and has become sick. They might say she has one year to live, to remain alive. We also use this word when referring to where you make your home, the act of making your home in a particular place. So for example, you, are, you have probably been asked this question many times, where do you live? Where did you make your home? And you might answer something like, I have lived in Spain for five years. So notice here that uh, we're using the same pronunciation for each time we use it as a verb. Live, lived, live, live, lived. Okay, let's take a look at the last usage for today. Finally, let's look at the word live. So here, this is an adjective or describing word. Live can relate to a performance that you see in person. It is not recorded. It's also a term we might use to talk about something that is connected to an electric current. So we'll talk about what that means. First, let's look at related to an in-person performance, how we would use live. I might say, I really want to see that band live. This means I like listening to their music, but I want to go see them play in person. I want to see them live. Or I'm going to a live Broadway performance. So not a recording, I will see the performance in person. And last, live is also commonly used to, in a sentence like, be careful, that's a live wire. So maybe after a big storm, some power lines fall down, oh, stay away, they are live wires, means there's still electricity in them, still electricity going through them. Okay, everyone, I hope that you learned about the important differences between live, live, and life. We'll see you next time on the English Danny channel. Please make sure to like, share, and subscribe for more English learning videos from our team of real English teachers. See you next time.